Back for your education. The Nuclear Museum is welcoming homeschool students and families back to the museum for programming specifically geared towards them. We're joined this morning by Nuclear Museum Director of Education, Lisa Guida, to find out more about those homeschool programs and what they have to offer. Good morning, Lisa. Good morning. Thanks for joining us this morning. Thank you for having me. So during the break, Lisa told me that we were going to be doing a magic trick this morning, and it got yeah. me really excited. So what do we have going on here? So we are going to do a little magic trick using some science. Okay. We each have a cup in front of us and some water. So we're going to pour our water into our cups. The whole, all of it? All of it. Okay. Okay. Lisa, while we're doing this, tell us a little bit about your homeschool program. So our homeschool program serves um, pre-K through 12th grades. We have three different sessions, pre-K, K-1, 2 through 3, and 4 through 6. Okay. Or for through uh, 12. Um, and we explore all these concepts. Okay. I want you to go ahead and dump your okay. cup of water. Oh. So where did our water go? Hmm. So I'm going to show you really quickly. Inside this cup, and we'll get to touch it in a minute, inside this <laughs> cup we have a little <laughs> bit of white powder. It's a sodium polysaccharate. Okay. Fancy term for a polymer. Um, I'm going to, once you pour water into it, it almost instantly turns into a solid. Yeah. That oh. material is commonly used in diapers. Okay. So you can see. Okay. Yep. You can see if you can touch it. Go ahead. Oh, <laughs> that is a cool texture. Yeah. So what happens if you've ever played with Insta Snow? It's the cousin to this polymer. Okay. And you put water in it and it expands and it's cold. So similarly with this, we can turn this back into a liquid by adding salt. Oh. And so you just add a little bit of salt on here. It'll start um, rehydrating this back into a liquid. We'll just stir it up. And these and are the kinds of experiments, sorry, that you guys do during these homeschool classes. Absolutely. Um, so is there a fee to participate in these classes? There is a fee. Um, it's $12 for this for okay. one session, or you can pay by the semester. Um, if you pay by the semester, obviously you get a little bit of a discount with okay. that. Um, so we are registering for homeschool. We are also registering for our Martin Luther King Jr. day camps and our okay. president's cam day camps. Okay, and when are those camps? Martin Luther, Martin King, Luther King Jr. Jr. Day. day is uh, January 16th okay. and President's Day, I believe, February 20th. Okay, and when is the deadline to be registered for We those? can register until it's closed. Okay. So they, uh, you know, get online, register as soon as possible because they fill up quickly. Okay. And you can see here, we've turned it back into Complete, a liquid. Yeah. So we've magically disappeared and reappeared water. Um, mention one more time who can participate in your guys' homeschool program. In homeschool, pre-K, so ages okay. 4 uh, through 12th grade. Okay. And then the camps, all ages? Camps will be kinder through 6th grade. Gotcha. Okay. And for more information on where to register and how to get involved, where can our viewers go? You can visit our website at nuclearmuseum.org. Perfect. And you can also check out our website, always on krqe.com. It'll have a full recap of the interview and all of the information on the homeschool camps as well. Stay with us. We'll be right back.